Bob decided to put on a show. He's not much of a circus performer, but look, this is an invite to the 100 layers challenge. Sue doesn't like such tricks. Hey! Where is Sue's croissant? What a size. This guy could have been a spy if he hadn't been eaten. Eating mini croissants is easy, unlike this giant. But Bob likes difficulties. And dirt, too. But mosquitoes? Not very much. He missed. This is definitely a dirty game. Someone is gonna have a little surprise. Very small, but the guy doesn't mind the portion size. And his opponent is not confused by the packaging. This scene isn't for the faint of heart. Hey, where's Sue? Wow! She is really swimming in potatoes. It's impossible to gain weight with a sport. Bob got the giant again, but there are some nice little things. Maybe it's a molecular cuisine. Still, a mountain of gum is better. Now there will be a bubble. Or a face mask. Well, at least it didn't get on his hair. Bob found a strange way to play Jenga. But it looks super cool. Monica is doing great. But Sue has no luck with gum. Although everyone is failures. Now she can steal sweets peacefully. Bob is on a diet today. Someone will have a sweet life. And someone a bitter one. What a short pleasure. But Sue has 10 times more candy. Hey, where's the mountain of Snickers? Traces of crime on the face. But Silly Ross is unlikely to figure out the criminal. Interesting. Who gets the bigger portion? Probably not Sue. However, Ross was lucky. But Bob won the Grand Prix. It's a real fortune. It's time to find out who got what. Sue just hates onions. It's good that she got a mini dish. And for Ross, 10 layers of tacos, just a piece of cake. It looks like the chef is a fan of onions. And Bob too. How can he eat this? What a smell! From such an odor, even the reflection in the mirror will be sick. But not to Bob. It's possible only to dream of Oreo, especially with milk. However, Monica isn't lucky today. One layer and that fell apart. Only the beauty doesn't despair. But Bob eats with no drink. It's time to get to know each other, cookies. That guy will cope very quickly. What an appetite. This lady isn't going to share. After all, she only eats cream. It's time to collect a new dish. Jewelry work, but very long. Just a mutant, not a cookie. It's time to taste this giant. Sue didn't even leave a piece for her friends. What a greed! Eating a regular burger is not a problem. Unlike this monster. But Sue is starving. And Bob has a skyscraper made of cutlets. This guy needs plastic surgery. Or, there is an idea. The TikTok filter will help. 
It's a monstrous scene. The task is ridiculous, and laughter is contagious thing. What a kinders! This one is just a mockery. But how delicious! Why eat dessert with a spoon when there are more interesting ways? It tastes even better this way. Just a gift of fate. But it's time to do it away. Sue needs a support group. But eating dessert isn't so easy. This is an epic fail. Ross can eat this bacon and eggs forever. He has a great appetite. But his manners aren't that great. Bob unlikely will be full with this that crumb. But Sue will fill up to the dump. Unless, of course, someone else eats the breakfast. What? The thief couldn't even crawl away from the crime scene. Whoa. What a cocktails! But if there aren't enough cherries, it's time to be a gardener. Hmm. Bob probably had an A in botany. This is a real life hack. And Sue has enough sweets even without the pots. But appetites are growing fast. Making friends with gluttons is very profitable. Would Monica eat it all? Huh? The last berry is the most delicious. It was until it went bad. <laughs> Girls have a lot to learn from Bob. Time to start eating Pringles at speed. Monica is doing pretty well, but the opponent clearly has less chips. Even if she accelerates, she can't avoid defeat. Why arrange a race? Bob has enough chips for a week. If no one intercepts them, everything has boundaries, except for a woman's cunning. He will have to stay hungry. It only needs a couple of milk drops. Experiment was a success. But Sue has a bigger thing. It's time to catch a lucky break. So the ringlets are much tastier. But eating them one at a time isn't interesting. Where is Monica's milk? Watch out! The largest portions have their minuses. Is this a portion for Thumbelina? But it's not so easy to eat the crumb. What about separate meals? Ross has 10 times more snacks. And the problems with the sauce are the same. It's time to go to extreme measures. Somebody give him a bib. A horrible scene. Bob has so many snacks that it's no need in thinking small. The main thing is not to overdo. The guy started a dirty business. He has to share. It's great when there are more candies than one. A dozen can be eaten effortlessly, but enough performances. How fast can Bob do it? The girls don't mind helping him, but the guy has got it. There's only one last pull left. This is the bear boss of the 100th level. Now there will be a real fight. Bob can handle him easily too. What a dessert! That's a real feast! <laughs> Ten layers is even cooler. But Sue is unlucky. <laughs> Only Bob eats the sweets carefully. 
But this tower is just endless. He needs to speed up before everything melts. It seems to be for a long time. Is that all? Bob almost became a snowman. 